Despite our results, and despite that many of our students and parents are generally very complimentary about the school, we do understand some children find coming to school and learning in a classroom environment challenging. We would like to think that we focus on every child to help them be the best they can be. And as such, through our school development plan, we are very critical of ourselves in those areas where we know we can improve. A great deal of focus has taken place on ensuring that we do the very best we can for each and every student that attends our school. Do we get it right each time, every time? Of course we don't. But I firmly believe that we do try to get it right each time, every time for each child. Helping our students to be the best they can be means that we, as a school, must be the very best we can be each and every time. When Mr Stenhouse retired after four years as head to take up a senior position within the Trust, it was an incredible honour to be appointed as his replacement. Only the sixth head teacher in our 62 year history. The level of stability in senior leadership is vital to the success of any school and having served on the leadership team for 10 years, including three as deputy head, I feel well grounded in the history of the school to take on the mantle of leadership. My vision for the school is encapsulated in our mission statement to continually put our students at the heart of all our activity, to enable them to develop into happy, hard-working and caring people who aspire to be the best they can be and ensure we are bringing their aspirations to life. This is more than just about exam results. Our results place us in the top 10% of state secondary schools in the country. Students make progress here, roughly half a grade more than similar students in similar schools. But I want our school to turn out young people who will make a difference and who will be a force for good in the world. That's why I believe our values are just as important as our exam results. We want our young people to reflect those values, what we call the five C's of Crystalton. Firstly, caring, to appreciate others, to have compassion, integrity, and a strong sense of justice. A commitment to high standards, not just results, how we perform on the playing field, on the stage, persevering and going the extra mile. To be creative, to be curious, to try new things, to be open-minded and to reflect. Collaborative, teamwork, sharing, supporting, and being inclusive. And finally, cheerful. No one wants to spend time with someone who's miserable. We want our students and our staff to enjoy being at Crystalton, to have a can-do approach, and to show humility. These values are instilled in our staff, and when we interview candidates for jobs here, we try to ensure that every person appointed in whatever role is capable of living up to those values. We are lucky in that we have many members of staff who have worked here a long time. We have very little staff turnover. We have four new members of staff who joined us this year, but three of them are covering for colleagues who are on maternity leave. 